Correlation between trauma and self-awareness. First, let's understand that self-awareness has two parts, internal and external self-awareness. I did a full video on this on my page if you wanna see it. So when we go through trauma, we typically develop high external self-awareness or awareness about how other people perceive us. This develops as a way to keep us safe. Now, internal self-awareness is something that we have to find on our own because without it, we can't fully heal our trauma. So becoming aware of self is the process of learning that you are made of many parts or sub-personalities. And each of these parts has its own actions, urges, beliefs, feelings, thoughts. Becoming aware of yourself is the first step. And the second step is unblending these parts from your true self. As you separate from your parts, you can start to experience your true self and start to feel and experience what it's like to feel self-energy. Once you've done this, you can now use this knowledge to begin to heal and become more self-led, meaning you would become more curious, compassionate, calm, connected, courageous, creative,